Hey everyone, I'm prepping for an online June 4th class on the Quadratus Emborum. This will be for acupuncturists. And I have with me this old tensegrity model. So this thing I got about 20 years ago, it's losing a little bit of its integrity, but it's a great model because it shows things like the upper ribs and the lower ribs. It shows the shoulder girdle and it shows the pelvic girdle. It shows the spine and the sternum. So we can learn local techniques for the quadratus emborum. We'll be covering those. It's an important structure. We wanna be able to affect change locally, but then when we affect change locally, we wanna understand how that local dysfunction is relating through the tensegrity of the torso with things like maybe the opposite side levator scapula or the pectoralis minor. We wanna affect change in the whole tensegrity of the body so that the patients can hold the changes we do locally. So this is very much a key part of uh, Chinese medicine that we're working with these relationships in the body. We'll be covering this in the upcoming class.